welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is progress and welcome to my youtube channel if you're old welcome back all right so today i'm gonna be trying for the very first time vietnamese pho i hope i'm pronouncing that right but this is gonna be the first time i'm trying it so this is gonna be a mukbang uh so this is what it looks like it has a bunch of stuff in it has onions shrimp so i got the seafood pho there's onions, shrimp, um, the noodles, of course, um, green pepper. It has a bunch of stuff in there. I'm excited and scared at the same time because I usually don't like trying new things at all. So this is my first time trying it. I'm also going to be trying chopsticks for the first time. Yay! I've never used this before. I don't know how to use it. I didn't even watch our tutorial on how to use this at all. So I'm just going to be diving in head first okay not knowing how to do nothing uh, it comes with the broth this is the broth and before i left i asked the waitress and i asked her how you know this works and she said just take a little bit of the you know the noodles put it in a little bowl right here and add the broth and you're good to go so that's what i'm going to be doing now so um i'm going to use this i'm going to take just a little bit of noodles I want to a little bit, okay. Maybe all of it. So, in the bowl, I need a few shrimp, because I love shrimp. Shrimp. I think we have crab meat, too. That. I love onions, so I'm gonna go with just a little bit of onions. It's crab meat. I don't know what this is. Do you guys know what this is? I don't know what that is. And I also do not know what this is. I don't know what that is. So I'm gonna just leave that one there. Do just a little bit of the lemon. I sincerely hope I'm doing this right because I'm literally just diving head first. So I'm gonna add the I'm gonna add the broth into the bowl. Guys, it's crazy. Oh, it smells so good. So that's gonna be it for the broth. Okay. I'm gonna set this to the side. I'm gonna start with my chopsticks. Okay, so how does this work, guys? Please let me know. How do you use this again? This way or that way? Okay, so I'm guessing it's this way. Ah, uh, it's not working. Ooh. Oh my god, this is. Ooh, come on! Come on. I'm already making a mess. Look. All right. So I'm going to add a little bit of sauce because it came with a sauce. I don't know if I should put this in the soup. But I'm going to set the sauce to the side. And figure out this chopstick. It's very different. It's very, very different. Mm. It actually tastes. It tastes real nice. Mm. 
So, I kind of feel like I need to add just a little bit of salt. I don't know, maybe that's what the sauce is for. Let's see. I'm just gonna dip just a little bit because I don't really know where the sauce goes. So, see that? I'm gonna leave it like that because. Wow. That is hot. I'm sorry, guys, I'm making a whole lot of mess, but bear with me like I said this is the first time I'm using chopstick and I'm not entirely terrible I feel like I'm a natural it's natural it's coming natural to me um, so I'm gonna try the crab meat good guys it is so good mm. this is the first time I'm eating this I love the shrimp. controlling me and I want to control it but it's controlling me like come on bro oh um, yeah I don't know what that is so I'm gonna skip that yeah I don't know I don't know what this is so I'm gonna skip that as well The crab meat, I don't know if this is... Guys, this is delicious, guys. Like, so if you're eating it and you're like uh, you need just a little bit of flavor that sauce right there it's like sweet and hot so it's the combination of both it's great this is what the bowl looks like this is also the first time I'm trying chopsticks and I'm gonna say I didn't do bad at all I did not do bad at all I did great guys look look see that See that? This is a first timer trying. See that? So I actually just learned how to use chopsticks on the spot. Yay! To rate this food right here, I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10. Cause to be honest with you, I was a little bit scared to try it. Cause like I said, I don't like trying new things, and I 
kind of shy away from trying new food and I love just eating what I'm used to what I know and so when I you know thought of this I was like uh, am I gonna like this am I not gonna like it I'm super excited that I actually do because now I know that this is gonna be my new spot to go get fa guys I am into fa and I'm gonna cut this video short because I don't want it to be so long I'm gonna be eating this in private Okay, right, I'm gonna finish this whole thing by myself but I just wanted to do this and show you guys that if you're running away or shying away from trying new things you have to stop that you have to go out get out of your comfort zone try a new food it can be a nigerian food you can try jollof rice you can try something different something of a different culture um that you know just try something else you never know what you're missing on the other side and yes i have been missing because this thing have been in existence for the longest time and i didn't know about it so i'm very happy that i tried it i am um I'm gonna continue eating my food but if you haven't subscribed to my channel don't forget to subscribe to my channel I'm sorry this video is short but I don't do well eating and talking so I'm just gonna head out and continue eating my food alone but if you haven't subscribed to my channel don't forget to subscribe like this video let me know what you guys think and please tell me what you think about fa if you've actually tried it if you haven't tried it before you might want to try it and let me know if you're gonna try it if you've tried it before let me know what you think about it and i'm gonna be seeing you guys next video bye